here's a Word document with a DDE auto with the example payload sitting in there. It'll just launch calc. Um, but it's a bit visible, isn't it? Even if you execute it, it's it, it's kind of visible to the user. So I was presented with the task of making it a little bit stealthy. Um, so one of the first things you can do is um, copy it, dump it into uh, the footer, because actually the reason that the footer is a good shout is because if we go across multiple pages here, right? If you do Control A, select all the text in the document. That's what Control A does. Um, you don't actually highlight the, the the text in the footer or in the header, so it's actually a good place to put it. It won't just be shown up, um, because if you um, actually select a field code in Word, it, it makes it nice and grey in the background. So if you select it, you would, you would be exposing yourself. So what we want to do is the first thing um, that strikes your mind is you go, let's just make that as small as we can make it. Well, if you drag it, then effectively eight is still clearly visible. Um, the smallest font size you can you can actually go for is one, but still a little bit visible. You know, if if the user zooms in, they'd they'd spot that. So the the simplest solution is to just take a print screen um, of the the sort of same size over to the left of it, paste that in, select the image, and tell it to be uh, in front of text, right? So now we've put an image into the footer that is the right size for us to cover the text. It's now pretty much, visually at least, um, uh, hidden from the user, right? 